for the past 20 years it has been a remarkable uh, journey in the big days we made a few decisions we said will be different ngo will be highly uh, transparent uh, accountable and trustworthy we also said that we will work in rural india because it is in rural india that the greatest poverty lies my wife and i established a foundation in india and the foundation is called as some sagal foundation there are three critical problems in india one is water security the other is food security and the other is uh, social justice india is a water stressed nation the second biggest problem in india is food security even now we are struggling because we have the largest malnourished population in the world the third problem which is the biggest problem in india is the social justice because of your illiteracy and lack of knowledge you really don't know what are your rights i remember my very first visit to our very first village i will never forget that visit what i still remember is when we were leaving the village at that time and said i were good byes one lady came up to me and she said india has forgotten us when i looked at the village yes it was totally neglected there was nothing and the look in her eyes and she felt so defeated so totally hopeless uh, lately we added another program uh, called transform lives one school at a time previously the school was in ruins that's all i could see there was no teacher there was no drinking water with our help and the improvements in the school it looks nice and the students are there and it is wonderful to see how the children are interested they want to learn their eyes sparkle and they have plans for the future mai apni life mein aage ja kar ek government teacher banna chahti hu jisse mai apne samaj ke liye kuch kar saku all four programs had a great impact as as is evident by many many awards which we have won over the past 20 years Non-profit sector impact is your bottom line. 
there has to be impact and that impact has to be sustainable. So that means the villagers will continue to make progress, that maintain it, they can build upon it and not destroy it. So I think it was very, the driving force, force for us was the impact and sustainability. As we enter the next decade of our work, we must continue to adapt to new challenges created by climate change in water security, food security, and social justice. We are now in 800 villages, which is very different from our very first visit to four villages. The future, I think, looks a lot better. That is my hope.